Eupelry Vial for Nebulizer is a long-term medication used to treat chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, COPD. It is important to use this medication regularly to reduce and prevent symptoms such as shortness of breath, cough, and wheezing. Eupelry Vial for Nebulizer belongs to a class of drugs known as anticholinergics. It works by relaxing the muscles around the airways so that they open up and you can breathe more easily. It's important to note that Eupelry Vial for Nebulizer does not work right away and should not be used to relieve sudden breathing problems. If wheezing or sudden shortness of breath occurs, use your quick relief inhaler as prescribed. It is recommended to take Eupelry Vial for Nebulizer at the same time each day to maintain its effectiveness. The usual dosage is one veal once a day, every day. Be sure to follow your doctor's instructions for the best results. Before using Eupelry Vial for Nebulizer, make sure to read the patient information leaflet and instructions for use provided by your pharmacist. This medication is used with a nebulizer, which turns the solution into a fine mist for you to inhale. It's important to learn how to prepare, use, and care for the nebulizer properly. If you have any questions, ask your doctor, pharmacist, or respiratory therapist. Make sure the medication is clear and colorless before using it. Check for particles or discoloration in the liquid before using it. If you see anything unusual, do not use the medication. Inhale this medication into your lungs using the nebulizer as directed by your doctor, usually once daily. Do not mix with other medicines in the nebulizer, and avoid getting it into your eyes. Each treatment usually takes about 8 minutes. Use this medication only with the nebulizer and do not swallow or inject the solution. Clean the nebulizer after every use according to the manufacturer's directions. If you are using other inhaled medications at the same time, wait at least one minute between the use of each medication. Use this medication regularly at the same time each day to get the most benefit from it. Do not increase your dose or use this medication more often than directed. It's important to learn which of your inhalers slash medications you should use every day and which you should use if your breathing suddenly worsens. Ask your doctor ahead of time what you should do if you have new or worsening cough or shortness of breath, wheezing, increased sputum, waking up at night with trouble breathing, if you use your quick relief inhaler more often, or if your quick relief inhaler does not seem to be working well. Tell your doctor if your symptoms do not get better or if they get worse. If you experience a runny or stuffy nose, be sure to let your doctor or pharmacist know. It's important to remember that this medication has been prescribed because your doctor believes that the benefits outweigh the potential side effects. Most people using this medication do not experience serious side effects. However, in rare cases, it may cause a sudden severe worsening of breathing problems. If this happens, use your quick relief inhaler and seek medical help immediately. Contact your doctor if you experience any difficulty or pain while urinating. Seek medical help right away if you notice any eye pain, swelling, or changes in vision. A serious allergic reaction to this product is rare, but if you notice any symptoms such as rash, swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing, seek medical help immediately. If you experience any other effects not mentioned here, be sure to contact your doctor or pharmacist. Before using Eupelry Vial for Nebulizer, it is important to inform your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies, as this product may contain inactive ingredients that could cause allergic reactions. Make sure to discuss your medical history, especially if you have a personal or family history of glaucoma, urinary problems, or liver issues. If you are planning to have surgery, be sure to inform your doctor or dentist about all the medications you are currently using, including prescription drugs, over-the-counter drugs, and herbal products. For pregnant women, Eupelry Veal should only be used when clearly needed, so it's essential to discuss the risks and benefits with your doctor. It is also unclear whether this medication passes into breast milk, so consult your doctor before breastfeeding. As for the daily dosage and optimal timing, it is crucial to follow your doctor's instructions on how to use this medication with a nebulizer, and when is the best time to take it for your specific condition. It's important to be aware of potential drug interactions when using Eupelry Vial for Nebulizer. Interactions can affect how the medication works and may increase the risk of serious side effects. Always keep a list of all the medications and herbal products you are using, and make sure to share this list with your doctor and pharmacist. Do not make any changes to your medication dosage without consulting your doctor first. 
If someone has taken too much Upelri and is experiencing severe symptoms like passing out or difficulty breathing, it's crucial to seek immediate medical attention by calling 911. Alternatively, you can contact a poison control center for assistance. In the U.S., you can reach out to your local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222. Canadian residents can call a provincial poison control center. Symptoms of overdose may include nausea, vomiting, dizziness, and lightheadedness. It's important to be aware of these signs and act quickly if they occur. It's important not to share this medication with others. If you smoke, quitting is the most important step you can take to treat COPD. Talk with your doctor or pharmacist about programs and products that can help you quit. Since the flu virus can worsen breathing problems, ask your doctor or pharmacist if you should have a flu shot every year. It's important to have regular lab and medical tests, such as lung function tests, while you are using this medication. Be sure to keep all medical and lab appointments. If you forget to use Upelrevile for nebulizer at the scheduled time, use it as soon as you remember. If it is close to the time for your next dose, just skip the missed one and continue with your regular dosing schedule. Do not take a double dose to make up for the missed one. This medication works best when taken regularly, so it's important to stick to your prescribed dosing schedule. Make sure to store Upelrevile for nebulizer at room temperature, away from light and moisture. It's important to keep it out of the bathroom and away from children and pets. When you no longer need it or it's expired, make sure to properly discard it as advised by your pharmacist or local waste disposal company. And remember, never flush it down the toilet or pour it into a drain unless instructed to do so. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.